deadly rampage in Las Vegas. We're learning more this morning about the killers. The couple reportedly had extremist anti-government views and they were out to kill cops. ABC's Ryan Owens is in Las Vegas and has the latest for us. Good morning, Ryan. Good morning to you, Robin. Behind me is the shopping center where this all happened. Police say this young couple came here hunting for police officers to kill, and they found them. We have two officers down. Uh, one CPR both of them this time. Police say a man and a woman are responsible for so much bloodshed in this Las Vegas shopping center. Officers haven't identified the cop killers by name, but overnight police and the FBI searched a nearby apartment complex where neighbors say a couple in their late 20s was well known as militant and talked about their plan to murder police. They were going to kill as many officers that they, that they can and they were going to do away with themselves. And that because um, they, they actually told us they didn't believe in the government, the feds or the cops, and they just wanted to get rid of as many as they can. Neighbors say the couple were white supremacists and the local newspaper, the Las Vegas Review Journal, reports police found swastikas and other neo-Nazi paraphernalia in the apartment. At 1122 Sunday morning, the couple walked into this pizza restaurant and made good on their threats ambushing two officers on lunch break. 41-year-old Alan Beck and 31-year-old Igor Saldo were killed. The Review Journal also reports the killers draped the officer's body with cloth, showing a Revolutionary War era flag. He just told me to tell the, the cops that it was a revolution and he had just killed two cops inside CCs. They weren't done. Five minutes later at 1127, more shots fired across the street inside this Walmart. Witnesses say the gunman yelled, everybody get out, but not before one of them killed a third victim, a woman, just inside the front door. The duo then exchanged gunfire with police before retreating to the back of the store. There, they carried out a reported suicide pact. The woman shooting her partner and then herself. The two officers who were murdered are husbands and fathers. One of them has three children, the other a newborn baby.